Oh, Dude, she's getting hit. <laughs> oh, give me my horse. Get off. She did get me. Good morning, y'all. So today we are going cowboying, and right now I'm actually catching my horse. And uh, I want to show you guys how we catch these horses in these big pastures and how it makes it so easy. Watch this. It's called a grain bag. <laughs> they all come running when you shake that grain bag. Makes it really easy when it comes to uh, getting your horses caught. So anyways, I got my steed for the day caught and uh, we're gonna go cowboying boys. Woo! Okay, so we're getting loaded up. Today, we're gonna head out way out there to Gold Butte. So we're gonna get loaded up here. Clancy's riding red. And uh, Cash is riding Kronk, so it's gonna be a dang good day. All right, howdy y'all, so uh, Today we are heading out to a far part of our ranch. It's called Red Rock. Um, what's kind of the plan today, Clancy? Well, cows come off of Lake Mead. They go up into that Red Rock country for the winter. And that's kind of where we gather them. That's kind of where they gather to. So we're going to work that Red Rock country over, make a loop around into Gold Butte. Because that's where the road takes us, and then we'll come right back towards home. We'll just get whatever we need, whatever we see. Yeah, and so we got, it's just going to be the OG crew today. We got Cash Hay back there. So we're, uh, hold up just a second. Sorry, folks. Okay, so anyways, it's going to be a good day. Um... We try to start off with a prayer every morning, so we're not the perfect, but we're gonna do it again today. So uh, I'll go ahead and say it. Our dear and gracious Heavenly Father, we thank thee for this beautiful day, and we thank thee for thy love and thy spirit and for our families. Father, we ask that thou will bless us with thy spirit and with safety as we, we capture these cattle today, that our horses will be strong and our dogs will be safe and that the cows will be healthy and that we can bring them home and good health. Father, we love thee very much. We ask thee for thy spirit that we'll be able to be of good joy and be able to work together and please bless our families as we are away from them, as we are away from them, that they will be able to be safe and also feel thy spirit. Father, we love thee and we thank thee and we say these things in the name of thy son, Jesus Christ, amen. All right, boys, whoop and spur. Ow! Okay, so, thanks Bandit. Okay, so Arden and Cash, so there's a calf, the calf that got away from us the other night. You can see him right down there with his mammy. I'm gonna stay in the truck and keep my dogs because we won't need them, but these two are gonna go get him. So Arden can have a payday, because it is Arden's calf after all. It is, huh? It is, our nice little red bull calf. So here we go, they're gonna go get at him. <laughs> Freaking nice day, huh? A little crisp. Just Start perfect. Just I'm perfect. That's why we're out here with the big guns. <laughs> big guns, boy. Uh, I guess we can just freaking rope and pull them out of there, huh? Nice and easy, like. Yeah. 
Well, it's just whoever gets a good shot at them, let's just put a loop on them. This brush is a rope grabbing pig! Oh! That brush kept grabbing my rope. Get out of it. Every time and yanking it down. Dude, I was like, I was like, oh, he's got it. I was like, crap, I missed. Got her? Yeah. Dude, I had him roped three times, but like as soon as my rope went over the nose, the brush just grabbed it and ripped it right off his whole body. now we'll load up and continue down the road. Alright y'all so we got a package in the mail. We're not really sure what it is but it says to the Bundy Ranch so we're gonna go ahead and open it up. I think I have an idea. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, boys. Check these out. Grumpy bags. I have one. Yeah, you got exactly you the same thing. So these, oh, these are cool. So these are called Brumby bags. They're from a company called Canvas Cutters. Um, they reached out to us and they wanted to work with us and they sent us these uh, to work with and see where, uh, well look at these things. Oh wow, it's got like, it's got three different go. zippers on it. You got a big, big zipper to put all your big stuff in, a little small side zipper. It's already got an extra hold tab on it because they know I'm a little clumsy. 
So you got two small pockets on top or bottom on the bottom. On the bottom. I think. I haven't had to figure out how to set it up yet. And a big one on the top. So this is pretty cool that we're getting to work with these guys. They reached out to us and uh, wanted to help us out. And uh, in return, we said we'd uh, we'd help show off their product. So this is super cool. Make sure to go to canvascutter.com and uh, go check their stuff out. They got, so these are saddlebags. We actually, this is kind of funny that they sent us this. How long ago was it when you got one for your boy? Oh, about a year ago. About a year ago. Little boy, bring your horse up here. So we actually have had one. Turn Keep him around. Going. Keep going up right there. So we've actually had one right here, as you guys can see. Goes right behind. You said you've had this for about a year. No, yeah, two years, about two years. About yeah, two about years, two and so, you know, they last, and it's nice, especially out here on the ranch. You can put your waters and anything you want in them, and they kind of stay out of the way, so you can still rope and everything. This but, would have been nice the other day when my horse decided to take a swim. It might have kept all my stuff a little drier. <laughs> yeah. I doubt it. He was upside down. I doubt it would have been drier. There's actually... <laughs> I don't know what this is. There's, there's about six compartments. Yeah, there's no, like Brundy. tons of them. Anyway. Anyways, thank you guys. And uh, you guys will be seeing more of these and more videos. So there you go. Thank you, canvas cutters. All right. So we just hit a good little jackpot at least. Look at these things. One, two, three. So there's three calves there. One, two, three more calves right there. Look at that, boys. Oh, that one's that got an orange tag in it. That's a cow then. Okay, so we're gonna get down below these, get out and get them all roped. Woo! Look at these cattle. Let go! 
Let go. Zip! Hey! You know better than that. Get! Get! So now that we got them all roped, we're going to lead all three of these back to the trailer and get them loaded. you lovers out there who think that cactuses are wonderful <laughs> you need your heads examined this place here is cactus heaven right here exactly them Everywhere. dogs don't like it and this is why we wear taps yeah, that's why that. we wear taps out that here folks. right through my foot or my boot Yeah. And that's why we don't wear chinks. Exactly. <laughs> you buckaroos can make fun of us all you want for wearing leggings. Guess what? We don't care. At least we don't have to worry about chinks. Yeah, we don't have to worry about our shins getting cactus or something. Exactly. You ready? Yeah. Get up. Come on, let's go. Let's go back to the trailer. Come on, kid. Your mama don't want you no more. Your mama don't want you. Every town has the taxes due when the taxes are due. Do, 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 do. Every town has the taxes due and the taxes is due. Do, 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 do. Oh, I love Robin Hood. This is the classic Robin Hood song. Robin Hood, little John running through the forest, laughing back and forth and just the other and had to say. And this and that and having such a good time, oodle lolly, oodle lolly, golly golly, what a day. I think I said that wrong though too. And 
and he spin that pony holding on to the Riata and he changed directions and spin him some and I watch and I wonder they're all over you ready? he ain't getting biased hey kid here hold on Well, Cash, Cash is going to hop in the truck and drive it up, and then uh, we'll get Clancy's loaded. Whew. They are. Okay. So this is the one Clancy rope. There you go, Clancy. <laughs> Look at him. He's a little angry. <laughs> Got him. We're gonna load back up and good dog, good dog. We're gonna load back up and uh, keep on going down the road. The What's the problem? I can't touch the pedals. That part is I didn't even scoot that? it back all the way. <laughs> How do we fix that? Push the button. Oh, there's a button there. Oh, okay. Just so everyone knows, when Clancy gets in a truck, a car, a tractor, I mean anything that the seat can move. He pushes it all the way up, which isn't the problem. The problem is, is when he gets out, he doesn't push it back out. <laughs> driving, so. so then when you go to hop in it, your knees hit the steering wheel, you can't get in. Right. Like my mama said, you don't breed poodles to poodles and expect great Danes out of the deal. So. <laughs> Do you that's, just call your mom and dad a do you just call your mom and dad a poodle? Well that's what she always called oh. me. So, okay. I never called her that. that. That's disrespectful. <laughs> you don't ever call your mama that. My mom ain't no oh, oh, shit, whole right. bunch of cows yeah. right there. Got it. Ooh, look at that whole herd of where's them. The, where's the... Clancy. Hold on. <laughs> We're moving too fast. There's one calf, two calves, three calves, I think, at least three. Well, let's get below them. Oh, oh, oh. Cash, are you biting the bit? <laughs> Clancy's just so excited. I don't know if that one on the front's a calf. Everything kind of calf is back this way. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go down here a little ways, kind of get below them, and kind of come up there behind them and try to catch them right here next to the road and get them loaded, boys. So what do you see, Clancy? Three? three calves in there that I can tell, but they're kind of moving At least three calves, so. Not for sure two, but the one might be replacement. It might be a heifer, so we're gonna go see and then Maybe a maverick cow or something, who knows? Alright. Whooping spur boys, let's go. Woo! That was one of those like uh, <laughs> Oh look, there's Lake Mead. Alrighty. Well let's get them unloaded. Can we see them? Oh there they are right there. They're on the move, boys. Let's get going.
Holy crap. So now that we've got everything roped, it's time to start loading everything. Clancy's GoPro wasn't working, so the heifer that he roped, we didn't get on film, but we just ended up branding her and letting her go. Right over there, Arden's coming with the truck. The cachet's got him ready to get up. You ready? There he's up. Back, dogs. Kind of funny how them guys sink without horn with you cut their horns like that. They can poke you and hook you and all you people that ask us why we do it well there's holes and but every horse on this ranch from that it's not us putting them in a dangerous spot it's just stuff happens and so that's why we cut them off so all right this is what i'm talking about so clancy drove the truck last look at this the steering wheels halfway there what is that it's like maybe a foot and a half away from the pedals <laughs> uh, so we gotta go all the way back after clancy drives on it uh. <laughs> okay all right i'll go over and pick them up load the ones they roped One, two, three, go ahead. Hey, 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 yeah. There you go. All right, you're good. Hey. Good job, Cash. Ow. Put the bully roped. Loaded. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. 
Okay. Hey, you guys got two more? Yeah, Cash's got a bull cap right there, and I got a heifer. Okay. Right Thank so you. Yeah. Clean that bunch out. Sounds good. Yep. Just... Hey, is this right here good when we're parked? Good. Good as any. All right. Well, we'll go get those other ones then. <laughs> oh. Oh. All right, one more time. Your nose in there, dude. dude, he's got those good little horns, don't he? Like, almost, like if they had two more inches on them, three, perfect fresh. These ones have been kicking, just so you know. I know. This one's not as much as the one plants you have. But if you want. Just go like this. You see that? Oh, got it. <laughs> oh, come let me out of here. Oh. Ah! Oh. He's a fresh horn. Yeah, he does. He's not bad sized. Roping steers, rope and ladies steer. and gentlemen, a roping bull, <laughs> 700 bucks. Oh. All right, so. Get out, get out, get out. Get out. Get out. So, uh, we got her branded and let her go. Bandit, hush up, good dog. And so, um, she didn't want to lead back the truck. And she's a good looking heifer, so we're just gonna leave her and uh, we'll get back to the truck and keep on going down the road. Call me, I'm a bullfighter. Jump him. <laughs> that actually worked out kind of good. That actually looked pretty good too. <laughs> Slow motion might look even better, dude. She's getting hit, you. Oh. Give me my horse. Get on. <laughs> she did get me. Alrighty. Get in there. Why would you do that? There you go. Get in there. So, we're loaded up. We got everything loaded. That one that clamps her up with branded, let go. And now we're gonna load back up in the truck and continue down the road a little ways. Whew. But we dang near got a full trailer load. So let's uh, load up and we'll we'll get going down the road. Hey 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 hey! All right, so we're unloading them. Hey 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 hey! Come on. Oh. All right, so since we're doing some electric work over next to the load and shoot, we just brought the truck and trailer down the alleyway here and got them unloaded. So let's go look at them real quick. So we separated them. We've been trying to separate all the big stuff and little stuff. So all the big bulls and steers that we've roped, we throw in here. Ooh, look at that big old steer. These are all right. So we put all the big stuff in here and then all the younger stuff, all the yearlings and stuff we put in here. I think today we just barely peaked over 30. So yeah. catched a lot of cattle. This is why everyone needs to remember to subscribe to our channel because We've roped every one of these things and we got it all on film. Ow! So, like I said, here's all the big stuff. That big thing right there, if you guys are wondering what that is, that's a feeder. So, uh, these guys with these big horns, they can fit their heads in there and, and eat out of it. And because they can't fit through the mangers over here like these little ones can. So. Anyways, got some good cattle. What do you got to say to the camera, Clancy? 
Whoop and spur, boys. Whoop and spur. That's what it takes some days. Yes, we sir. Ow. Cash, what do you got to say? You just got to do your thing. Do your thing, son. All right, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe. We got a lot more to go. And we're going back out tomorrow, so whew, thank you.